we knew that we were gonna have that power and that's pretty cool and this is probably gonna be one of the weapons that we're gonna use probably it's gonna allow me to destroy the figure yep beautiful wait what you have to do it pretty close on multiple times wait what Oh, you have to do it from higher. So you cannot just do it from whatever you want. You have to do the power. Gotcha. And then from here, we can keep exploring. But now we can even do this section over here, which could be interesting. But we all know that this section over here is just probably going to connect to this one, which again, it's something that I want to do, but not really. So let's just verify the rest. Now we are back in business. Okay, come on, baby. Let's go. You guys have no idea how different it feels. No, no, I need you. I need you to stay away from me. Now we can change to this big boy, and we can do a lot of damage to them. Oh boy. So even even if you have the other weapon, don't get too cocky, okay? This is not Blasphemous one. Things are not like they look like. Need to reach that section. Okay, that's fine. Now we have to change weapons. Goodbye. And then yeah, we can drop that one over there. All we need to do is move this all the way to the right. Run, run, run. Change weapons twice. Nice teleport. Fudge! I forget. You have to, like, do a blade assault right there if you really want to make it work. Ah, this is so hard. You really have to, like, make it work. Like, if you really want to make... If you really want this to, like, work... Like that. Let's go. The poison of jealousy. What do you give me? Involves a momentum of poison, which inflicts me a mass of damage all around, which we haven't used just yet. And then this one over here is just like a like a standalone section. Like I don't I don't really see anything else that you can do in there. Maybe secret wall? Oh no, never mind. There is like an item in there, so it doesn't matter. Probably should take that opportunity to trigger the the other shortcut. I, I I don't know. Maybe. Or maybe we can just keep going from the top. Can you even... So you have to do something like this and then... Oh, ho, 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 let's go! Be by lighting ball. Increases the damage... The, the resistance to lightning damage. That can come in handy this time around. Okay. Come on, bring it on. Not like that. Let's go! We are back in game. We are back in business, actually. But the only problem that we are having right now is that I need more damage. Because I'm, I'm kind of not used to the new damage. And that's a bad thing. Wait, you can go down. I really want to get my next brew dude. Once I get my next brew dude, then we should be able to do the rest. This one triggers the elevator. Yeah, that's fine. And then with that elevator, we can actually go down. Couple of fire places that we can use or powers that we need to trigger. Let's get that little shortcut over there trigger. That's fantastic. Just to verify where we at. Yeah, that's a great shortcut right there. Then we can probably go through the middle and see what's up. The merchants. What's up? What do you have for me now? 
We have money. This crown of majestic buildings was built to study the awe-inspiring glow, but hinted at the shape of a basilica once witnessed by fervent worshippers. No one has ever laid eyes upon it again until now. The miracle bestows its blessing upon us all by revealing to us what has long been hidden, invisible, and out of bounds. Cast your eyes upon our shop window. Yeah, I will. And we have resistance to fire damage. I mean, we have good money, so we probably should be buying some stuff. We have no more items left. But you never know what may turn up on these paths. Pray, come back later, penitent one. Sure deal. Uh, yeah, that's that's always good business to do over there. Because by doing that type of business over there, then of course, yeah, we, 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 we just got new stuff and getting new stuff is always great. Oh no! Can I? Let's go. Stay away from me, stay away from me. Yeah, you don't want that electricity to come your way. Kill this guy. Beautiful, that was great. And then we have another one of these ladies, which I am really... Oh, no. I don't... I don't know if this is possible. Uh, okay, one of them is down. And we have the fire. Stay away from him so that way the electricity disappears. Now get closer. Now he's dead. Beautiful. Beautiful. The fact that you can do the counterattacks is what makes this weapon so good. If it wasn't for the counterattacks, it would be hard. The rapiers are fantastic, but you gotta like have your your parry game like on point. If you don't have your parry game on point, say goodbye to your good luck. Show up again. Goodbye. Nope. Avoid them. Avoid them. Hello. Nice. So now we can actually go back in here if we want to. And we can explore the bottom section. So now that this is triggered, we don't really care about the rest. Seems to be a boss fight soon, so we are probably gonna try to trigger that boss if possible. But we will have to see. That's three hits. That's three hits over there too. Goodbye. Uh, do this. Triggering this power is gonna be a little hard, a little bit harder than I think it would. Oh no, never mind. It's just gonna trigger this one. That's perfect. And that triggers the other one. Beautiful. Yes. Those are those are the things that you want to see. Well, if there's a boss fight close, you guys know how it is. At this point, we are just going to wrap things up once we're done with the boss. Gotta keep triggering the shortcuts because this one is... I need something to take me down, right? Yep, there you go. And now this one over here, this one has just been triggered. Which, we can now use the power by jumping up and getting... The next one, and then from here, you guys know we have the baby. So even if we die, we can trigger this. Let's go down. Let's get that one moving. Oh, baby. Things are just pushing together. But don't kill me. And you need the elevator to be triggered so it's not that you can go from the bottom you actually have to go from the top okay that makes more sense i mean it it does make a lot of sense and then from here yeah we can teleport if we want to and that's probably exactly what we're gonna do we're gonna go here and teleport back why why would why would i not do something like that yes
Honestly speaking, Blasphemous is also one of those games that is kind of tough to record because there is so much to do and without noticing, you really end up spending hours in the game and you don't see that. So uh, that's something else that I might be wondering, like if some episodes just go beyond the length, just for the sake of it, I might just do like, you know, those messages of to be continued and then continue in the next section because that would only make more sense. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Definitely not the answer that we're looking for. Gotta kill that guy. He's dead now. Change to this power. Oh, no. We have to... Are you mocking me? Piece of shit. He was really mocking me. The fact that enemies can mock you now makes me upset. Beautiful. And that's another thing. It's a good... I would say that it was not so bad that we didn't decide to do Mother of Mothers yet. Because I feel like maybe in Mother of Mothers we will need every single power that we have right now. Or every single weapon. And yeah, we didn't have it before, so... It would have been a little bit bad for us. Don't kill me. Not like that. Okay, I get it. Yes! And we get an unfinished lullaby. Okay. Fragment of a lullaby written by a mother intended to... Oh! Yo! Do you guys think that that's a thing that we need for the mother that is with a child? Because that's the only mother with a child that we have found in this whole game. Oh, fuck me. Okay, now we can change and now I can destroy you. Perfect. This section is gonna be annoying. Don't give me more enemies. Of course it's gonna give me more enemies. Ah, oh, I'm one hit away from death. I don't think we can do this, guys. Not with our resting place. Okay, so I know what I have to do. I just don't know if I can do this. This is gonna go all the way up and... Well, no, actually, no. It's just gonna take me up. Go up. Are you not gonna go up? Okay. I mean, I thought you were gonna be going up automatically. And then I would have to, like, do it from the other side. But I guess they win. They really wanted me to work. So that's... Wait, no. I cannot get it. So then... How am I supposed to climb up? Unless... Yeah, this is strange. Because I can send it up. Right. Oh, you get... I was, I was overthinking it. I was like, how am I supposed to really get there? I was just overthinking it. Don't fall. Listen. Are you looking at your health? Are you looking at your health? Like, just, just take a look at it for one second and notice that that is not something that you want to mess up with. Now, we know that if that is a boss, there is a save in there. There has to be, otherwise it's behind us. But let's not take our chances and let's see. Tell me that there's a safety here. Yes. Okay. That's great. Now that we have that, we are going to trigger that. We're going to trigger that shortcut, then go back all the way up, ta tackle the boss, and then cut it out. Okay. You know, now that we have all the powers, there's so many sessions that we can probably trigger again that I'm just curious if I really want to go back and do them. Because those are also sections that I can do on my own. I don't I don't know if I have to do them with you guys. I will have to see because, again, there's multiple areas, but you never know which ones are good. And this is not something that we can get just yet. Okay. But it means that we have some shortcuts. We cannot really get the, I think, was some Tears of a Torment, but that's fine. And then we have another unfinished lullaby. And then from here, we are all the way back to one of the saves. Beautiful. Let's go back and let's tackle a boss.
Okay, let's see what is it that we're gonna face now. I do need to get rid of guild. I don't like that fervor, but honestly speaking, it's not so terrible. Um, let's take a look at some stuff beforehand. Got a couple of prayers, that's cool. But look at this. So this is fine. Pressing R at the last moment unleashes a devastating slash that strikes multiple enemies. That sounds good. If we can perform a chrism attack. We don't really care about those. Uh, we can change our weapons right here. This one is a cool attack in the mid-air. It looks so sick, but we're probably never going to really use that weapon. Instead, we're going to be focusing on you. I want to trigger you, so that way we can do the, uh, the block path, which empowers hits, which is fine. And then parrying during block path then launches a devastating attack. And this is increases mystical damage inflicted. That sounds really good. I don't know what mystical damage is. Um... <laughs> But well, physical damage is the damage that you deal with the blood pack. And the trigger, the way you trigger it is R plus X. Okay, so pretty much like this. Wait. No, not like that. Wait. I'm confused. Because it says this scene is the parry, right? And then you have to press plus X. Oh, with the gauge full to activate the blood pack. Okay, okay, okay. So we don't have the gauge full. That's fine. Let's go. See what type of fight this is gonna be. I live. No, you don't. I live again inside this merciless and cold metallic casing. A little bit sad. I can see your intestines, though. I live in this cage in the shape of what was long ago my body. Sorry about that, buddy. I live, and I feel that I am directed by forces that undermine mine own will. I live, although when I close my eyes in the intimate darkness behind my eyelids, I am still dead. Fight starts! No! Nope. I am not sure what you're trying to do, and this is insane. Yeah, not a huge fan. Wait, are you trying to be like Crisanta now? Was it Crisanta? Nah, it was the other one. The strongest best, the strongest boss in the previous game. What the fuck is this? Okay. Okay, that's the second one, that's the third one, beautiful. We're trying to use our sword as much as possible because it's awesome. And now we are freaking dead! Not anymore. <laughs> How does it feel to be Perry, you piece of shit? Second health? That's fine, that's fine. And now he's gonna do his crazy stuff one more time, that's okay. Are you gonna go phase two? Yeah, he is. Okay, now what's gonna happen? That, this makes more sense. I'm, I'm not gonna... What the fuck? Yo, what the fuck? This is a joke? Are they, is this supposed to be a joke? Are you serious? No, this is, this is, please tell me this is a joke. I cannot take this little fella seriously. Die. Just die. Please, wait, no, he's still alive! Another face. Okay, okay, it's not a joke. He is way stronger than... Oh, no, two of them? Oh, come on. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, that's fine. This is becoming tough. Trying to fight them two at the same time and both of them having different powers? Not my cup of tea. 
Ah, pretty bad, pretty bad damage. Okay, can I heal? Yes. Touch everything, beautiful. Now we can use the bell and try to see what that does to me. That's how you block that one. Beautiful. I understand it. Nice touch. That was bad. Okay, it might take me more than one try to defeat this fella. That's okay. Oh, look at my health. Oh my god. Shit. Well, second try. We have lost so much fervor, but we can do this. We understand the fight now. Let's take care of him. Let's go. Now, whatever you want to do, I already understand you. That's fine. Took a little bit of damage right there, which is okay. Now we can do a lot of damage with him or against him. Wait, I th I swear I should have blocked it. That was a really clean block on my end, and I guess the game said, "Nah, you didn't block shit." And this is fine. Just like I said, I did block it. It's your fault for being a piece of shit. Goodbye. Show up, little boy. Look at that. Pretty tough battle to do if you are not like blocking. Yep, just because of that. Those type of powers are really annoying. Uh, and he did hit me a lot. But now he's dead. Okay, bring it on. Come on, puppy. That was a lot of damage. Whoa! What the fuck? I think... Oh, I thought I blocked it. Fuck. Okay, no. That's... This is personal. That was... That was not a fair fight. He hit me with every single hit. I mean, I know that that was the intention, but... Motherfucker. Fucker, you start like that, really? You know what? Since that one is so easy to dodge, I am just gonna hit you with this. Now, what the fuck are you supposed to be doing, bro? Beautiful. And now just take the damage. He take the hit right there. That's perfectly okay too. Change to my little fella over here. Grow up. No, nope, don't kill me. I am gonna die. One more time against this guy. That's not fair. There's a level of fairness that this game needs to understand. No! I need to block that power. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just come to me. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. See, that's a little bit better. You dying like that, that's good, that's good, that's good. Nice dodge, can we kill him? Beautiful. And now he's dead. Okay, now I need to max out my health. Because now it's when the action comes in. And I have to be able to do some damage to the two of them at the same time. Shit. 
should be able to like kill him now. Wait, why are you here? Oh shit! When you have the power on, you cannot block! Oh, that's what happened. Oh, that's my bad. Yeah, I'm dead. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, oh, let's go again. This one is personal. This one is the one. Yeah, this one is the one. Now he's gonna start doing the jumps, and once he starts doing the jumps, that's 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 pretty much it. He this is his death sentence. Look at that. Does two hits. Three, four, five. Keep some distance and start hitting him. Do it again. Nice. Now he should go down soon. That's what I'm talking about. Do this power. Change. No, we, we want to use this one against him. Because this enemy is a little bit annoying and you want to do as much damage as possible every single time. That's okay. He's going down now. Beautiful. It doesn't matter how many times you guys are trying to freaking kill me. I am taking it personal right now. Touch that beautiful die. Use the power. Okay, that's fine. Heal up. Now we can do damage to the two of them at the same time. Don't get close to him. Dodge. Beautiful. Heal up. Almost there. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Dodge. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. This is okay. Come on. Yes, one of them is down. Okay, and now I need this guy to die too. Shouldn't be too difficult to kill him now. Stay away from him. And now he should go down. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Oh boy. That was. That was. Harder than it should have, honestly speaking. Okay, now one more talk to this guy and let's see what he has to say. Are you gonna be ugly as fuck or are you gonna be cute? You are just a painting. The fuck? Okay, what's up? Be witness to this vigil before my final journey. My body has been returned to me at last. I am now master of this flesh, of this trembling, of this agony. How sweet the pain when it is our own penitent one. You who came to witness the miracle, behold, But the miracle, who bestows and wrests away its grace with inscrutable agency, saw its will tarnished in its prolonged absence. Erring in its newly created work, it conferred on that child as much its own as that of another. The blessing of deformity, it spread throughout our land like a contagion. Its accursed seeds germinating like the wounds that sprout upon the scourged flesh of the repentant. 
The dying day already puts out its celestial light, causing my eyelids to droop. Let the miracle cast open its black gates, so I might venture to where that terrible dream, from which one never wakes, awaits. What do you have to say? The full testimony has been revealed to you, and the counterfigure of the witness has at last descended. The three great stone figures of the family have humbled themselves before us all. Raise your eyes as the dazzling beauty of the upper reaches of the city of the blessed name welcomes you. Now go forth. Let not doubt leave its vexatious mark upon you. Again, now she disappears. Now, honestly speaking, this is pretty much where we're gonna actually be wrapping things up for uh, the day. Uh, it seems like next episode we have to still explore a lot of this area. There's still many things to do. We still gotta explore over here. Finish up this whole section. We still do not know what else. We still don't have any more powers like double jumps or things like that that we can trigger. We have Mother of Mothers that we can explore. The Sea of Ink, we cannot do anything about. Probably we can come back to this section to see if there was anything that we missed because of the powers that we had. But, I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. I'm sure it's going to be one part or two parts. But I want to say thanks a lot for watching, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next one.